So just a short video, brace yourself everyone, we're going to a million cases and 50,000 deaths probably within 24 hours. So here's the latest data fresh out of John Hopkins University and we've got 932,000 cases. Yesterday we had 857,000 worldwide, okay, 932. So we've gone up by over 60,000 cases overnight. So within 24 hours or shortly after, we'll be over a million cases. The number of deaths in the last 24 hours has gone from 42,107 to 46,809. So an increase of over four, of about 4,700. So we're going to go to 50,000 deaths within 24 hours if, if the current trends continue, which they seem to be continuing. A quick look at the graphs. And uh, there's, there's the graphs of the data. Um, so we've got confirmed cases, recovered cases and deaths. Have a look at the log graphs. You can see the logs rising pretty steeply but starting to flatten out. I hope that's a good sign. I hope it continues to flatten out. And uh, But if you have a look at just the deaths, sorry, just the deaths, there's, there's a graph for that. And the normal graph, <laughs> when you look at the data normally, it's quite an exponential rise. So, and even the log graph is rising quite steeply. Anyway, just a short video. So just to brace yourself, get yourself ready for the media hysteria. We're going to a million cases and 50,000 deaths within 24 hours. And uh, all you can do is stay safe, practice your social isolation, wash your hands, and, uh, and uh, just look after your friends and family as best you can. Okay, there's no need for panic buying. There's no need for fights in supermarkets. As long as everybody just buys what they need, the food and the toilet paper will not run out. Okay, thanks for watching.